Hi babes and welcome to my channel and today we're going with an update on Selena Gomez and Benny Blanco's relationship. You guys wanted me to do this reading so here we are. We are going to um, start. I want to remind you guys that my readings have no date. They are divinely guided. Everything has very well. Not everything is going to resonate with everybody and please keep in mind that the um, energies can be inverted. The rose from could be as well so with this said let's move forward babes so we got the ace of cups right away so we got the star and that reverse um the ace of pentacles nine of swords the page of swords and that reverse the five of ones And also, I forgot to say that these readings are always for your entertainment purposes only, and everything said I mentioned is alleged. Throughout the whole video, you're always provided the legal disclaimers at the beginning of every video. Okie dokes. So we got a lot of water, which is obvious because I know Selena is a Cancer. So we got Pisces, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We got Aquarius energy, Taurus energies. We got Libra, Gemini, Aquarius as well. We got Scorpio and Leo, Aries again. So it does seem right here that... I feel like allegedly she's very very into this connection right she's very into this connection and allegedly she could get overly emotional at times uh, I do feel allegedly that he is more grounded in the sense that he's less emotional than her she could be more sentimental and it makes sense because she's uh, also a you know water sign and whatnot but either or regardless of sort of signs it does seem like her personality allegedly is more sentimental and his is allegedly a little bit less sentimental so with the nine of swords right here this is a sense of like allegedly feeling anxiety on her energies and I feel like allegedly here is because some people are like always like watching everything she says to get it out of context which it could be quite difficult as a person as a social media as a celebrity I do feel like you know she allegedly sometimes feels the um anxiety of people like watching her stuff to always criticizing her yada 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 i do feel like she has very good friends and all that but i feel like her connection with him is pretty the same honestly allegedly it's nothing has changed much i feel like allegedly is there's times that things may look easier other times that may not be as easy allegedly he could be a little bit immature and this allegedly could be a little bit difficult to deal with but it's nothing out of this world honestly uh with the th three of cups is soon to be allegedly a rumors of them getting engaged allegedly i know this is nothing new because it's been sparking like ah oh, she may do it but allegedly there's a big sense that they get engaged soon if not there's going to be uh rumors of them and get getting engaged soon like i said in my other readings which if you have seen it it should not come to you know again a shock for some of you allegedly a lot of people are gonna say that oh they're doing this because of Haley and Justin allegedly it's nothing to do with that people need to pass the page and move on everybody's living their life so allegedly it's not for that and allegedly it's gonna be a uh, engagement uh, party allegedly rumors if not the alleged engagement once again which again if you have seen my videos in the past it should not come to a surprise with eight of ones in the reverse uh, allegedly there's gonna be some sort of like uh rumors because somebody that could have been her friend or has been her friend for a long time allegedly may not congratulate her allegedly when it happens or there's going to be claims and rumors that allegedly she wasn't there which allegedly she wasn't but it wasn't because she wasn't invited allegedly it's because she was doing some other things when it comes to work or this could also be allegedly because some health situations nothing out of this world just something very sim very normal it's just allegedly that's the reason with justice in the reverse right here again people are going to allegedly say all these things but it's not true and allegedly they're gonna get redirected to the truth because allegedly people like drama a lot with a death card and the king of swords in the reverse allegedly whenever she gets uh engaged this uh alleged um Haley Bieber is going to say congratulations or something like that or give it a heart allegedly uh there's going to be a lot of allegedly screenshots of like people say oh my gosh she did she did she did uh some people are going to say that it is photoshop first allegedly is going to be photoshop and then allegedly it's going to be a possible 
truth which is she may say something or like it because they're amicable they're not in bad blood as allegedly the world thinks they are because again they have in a way to perform moved on from the original situation allegedly with the full right here as i said before this is a whole new situation and energies for my our beautiful selena she is heading towards bigger and better i do see allegedly travel as well i do see she's going to be doing a movie a new movie allegedly this is not whatever she has made i do see french i don't know why french um Paris and all that is involved but allegedly it's a different movie that she's allegedly going to be in as well in a different country uh and again it's not the ones that she's made until now it's new okay i mean to emphasize that um i do see allegedly this is going to have the relationship long distance for a couple of months due to work and you know schedule interference into where allegedly they may be seeing each other here and there and this could put a little bit of the relationship a little bit of tension In this movie, she's going to also change her hair. Allegedly, I see blue, but maybe it's not that. But I do see as well that... Allegedly, in the future, there could be, again, a even though this could be before they get married, allegedly, there could be a little bit of a pause or separation between her and her current boyfriend, allegedly. But it's, per it's not permanent. It's going to be temporary as well. There's going to be a lot of speculations of what cost it. Allegedly, she's not going to talk about it because it makes sense. as her personal life, and I'm not going to talk about it either. But with the three of ones right here, plans will continue because allegedly they will get back together. Um, I do feel that she's extremely in love with this person. It's also giving me, giving me an energy of mermaids as well. I don't know what that means, but allegedly here, they're going to get back together. And there's a huge possibility that they, that they could, you know continue their plans of marriage with the page of pentacles as well um there's going to be a movie as well allegedly with selena that people are going to ship her with her um co-star and allegedly people can get very intense with this fan edits as well allegedly into where people are going to try have to put it to like oh this is just a job they're not a thing they're just co-workers so allegedly that could be too with the four of pentacles there's people out there who are not leaving the julina stuff and i do feel like it's time to do so um allegedly there's a lot of people that are still wanting to judge her for whatever reason i feel like selena is extremely successful and that's what people get mad about i feel like people just hate to see successful females and no matter what she does she's always going to be criticized unfortunately but i do feel like selena is judged by people who lack of talent and lack of stability in any way to perform because i do feel like it just makes no sense to me you know the six of cups as well allegedly uh this is a sense that in the future she could have two kids right i do see allegedly to seeing selena in the future being a mother okay there's a possibility for that for her in any way shape or form that she wants it but i do see the possibility of becoming a mom there and she will be the best and most loving mom ever to be honest um i do see as well that there could be troubles in paradise in between her connection with her current boyfriend allegedly in the future as well but honestly it's nothing that out of this world because every relationship has ups and downs if you have been in a relationship you know how difficult it could be i do feel like again she's going to allegedly eventually be single for a bit because i do feel like there's a pause and breakup in between them allegedly but i do feel like they are going to get back after yep it's going to be surprising when they end allegedly and allegedly it's also going to be surprising when they get back together in the future and everybody's going to question everything everybody's going to question everything and say like this was a pr thing but allegedly it was not it's just like again relationship issues ups and downs yada 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 with the ten of ones here the bad tongues which is the malas lenguas which is people bringing unnecessary things to the table and i feel like all of these things that are going to come after allegedly with this um, assumptions and alleged allegations and whatnot are not true you gotta wait for the source to talk about it if she does i do feel like she may stay quiet allegedly but he may say something in the future without communicate in instagram or so with the ten of pentacles in the reverse right here 
I do see even though that they could be similar in a lot of things allegedly they are very very dif different as well into when it comes to maturity and all of that so allegedly this could be one of the things that could put uh, difficulties in their connection with the full and the reverse right here and the strength card uh, is just more about being empathetic about the situation I do feel like allegedly when things happen uh, mixing up the movie and all of that a lot of people are going to be on their you know focus on that so at the end of the day allegedly here with the six of swords i do not see the connection to be over i do see that it could be a pause like i said in my past readings it's still the same allegedly but i do see like it's going to be a pause and eventually again they're going to get back together with the nine of ones right here and the two of cups in the wheel of fortune i do feel like you know of course she knows better for what is best for her so a lot of people may not be happy about it because allegedly a lot of people don't like him that much for her but i do feel like she's not gonna listen to anybody she's going to again i'm uh, gonna be eventually uh, doing whatever she wants with with of course her decisions because it makes sense um when the emperor right here let's see what is this here um emperor the seven of wands and the chariot and the reverse i do feel like allegedly there's no point uh you gotta let her be i feel like allegedly there's gonna be somebody making you know comments that are gonna be super rude but eventually i feel like as of right now nothing has changed very big um she's gonna stay with him allegedly and i don't know why people are gonna still bring up her past juliana situation with the connection as of right now um there's gonna be allegedly somebody that could betray her in a way to perform allegedly this an old friend or so making a comment or liking a, a bad comment of her allegedly a friend or somebody that allegedly was close to her may be liking it as well and people were gonna actually take a screenshot of that and make a big fuss about that allegedly but with the seven of cups overall she's surrounded with a lot of love and a lot of people who care for her she has amazed an amazing fandom and i feel like even in her most difficult time she's going to be still supported and she has a lot of people who love her who care for her and who will support her and defend her if needed but overall i do feel that everything works out just fine i feel like it's just like everybody's life and everybody's relationship but the sad thing is that she happens to be a celebrity which is everything she does is going to be just looked and straight you know stared at because she is a celebrity so again is nothing much that i can tell you that's different it's the same as the past i do feel like ups and downs and difficulties so things will happen regardless and things are going to happen when they need to happen not when we want it to happen so allegedly right here like i said before nothing out of this world is just a normal life and a normal relationship who happens to have ups and downs like i said in the in the in the past because again unless you have never been in a relationship you never know and it's gonna be a lot of things happening allegedly so we gotta wait for it to happen and you will remember this reading and the ones i did before because again i just don't like to tell you the same thing that i know i said before so if you want to know more details you gotta go to the other readings as well okay because again i already i already talked about it babes but for my subscriber who asked i hope you liked it because um, it's pretty much what I saw. Let me give uh, Selena this reading today uh, angel number. And then I'll be done for today. So the first one is 1011. And it says take action. And this says... Um, hope, new beginning, fresh start, lifestyle, purpose, spiritual awakening. This is a call to action to move forward. The sooner you get going, the sooner you will accomplish what you set out to do. Those with patience will eventually reap the rewards of their perseverance. Then we got 1414 and it says um, light up, mood swings, respect, family, constructive outlook and quality. Focus on your needs, desires, and hobbies. Everything is more accessible with a light attitude. You will be blessed with new opportunities and new friends or an addition to your family. Good advice will speed up the process. And they told me to look at the bottom of the deck. Oh, 1001. And it says spiritual awakening, new beginnings, personal development, prioritizing creativity, and heading in the right direction. A new phase in a religious or spiritual quest. Uh, you're going through a spiritual awakening which can't which can feel like the dark night of the soul. You're on the path to enlightenment and this too shall pass. 
so guys this is the end of the reading i hope you guys liked it um please of course don't forget to give it a thumbs up subscribe comment also i want to encourage you to follow me outside of youtube you can follow me on instagram uh facebook twitter uh spotify as i do podcasts every two weeks in english and spanish uh you can follow me also in the news and the new app which is threads which is connected to the instagram uh all the links are always going to be in the description box below also i offer personal readings and if you want if it's easier you can check out my instagram and you'll find all the links and all the uh, platforms that i'm part of anyways thank you so much and you guys have an amazing day and many blessings